Welcome to beautiful Antigua. So here are all the people beach bumming it with us today. There she is. Okay, we made it back to our stateroom and we're gonna get changed and go back into town. Look what I found! So excited! Hi, I'm Matthew. And I'm Susan. Together we love to travel. One of our favorite places to be is aboard a Norwegian ship at sea. Good food, drinks, and friends make a relaxing trip indeed. So come along with us as we let the sea set us free. Well, now that we're dry and changed and got the sand out of our butt cracks, and everywhere else. Um, we are going to go back into town to do a little um, exploring of the local shops uh, before we have to be back on board in an hour and a half. I feel like I'm just swimming upstream because everybody's going back to the boat and we're heading back into town. They decorated their Christmas tree with steel drums. Pretty cute. Sunset. So pretty. Another port that I wish I had more time in. Okay, getting back on the ship. Good evening. Hello. So the color of the night is purple. Um, we are going to go hit the photography stations and then we have dinner at Onda tonight. Let's hope it goes better than last time. Appetizers are here. Trace got the margarita pizza. Maria and Matthew got the beef carpaccio, and I got the Frito Mista. Main courses have arrived. Maria got the salmon. Matthew got the tuna. Trace got the ravioli stuffed with short rim, and I got the pappardelle bolognese. Desserts are here. Trace and Maria both got the butterscotch budino. I got the tiramisu, and Matthew got the cheesecake. We just got back from Wanda. The food was good. Um, my gripe with Wanda is that portion sizes are not consistent among entrees, among appetizers. The pizza that Trace got was really good. The size of Susan's appetizer was amazing. 
and the size of Maria and my appetizers were eh, much to be desired. Plus, the taste was okay, and you know, I wouldn't have chosen that if I had known what it looked like and would much rather have a La Cucina appetizer because I know what I'm getting and the consistency is there. On entrees, Susan's entree came out the way that I would expect an entree to come out. Trace's came out a little bit smaller than I was expecting. Maria's came out wonderfully and then the tuna that I ordered came out on the same size plate as the appetizer that I received and while it was good, the flavor was excellent, it felt like an appetizer, not an entree. Yeah. <laughs> it would be great. Let's go. The jury's still out. Let's go. So now that we are done with our drinks and corn nuts at Sugar Cane Mojito Bar, it is time to go to dinner at Onda. For appetizers at Onda, Matthew got the burrata, which contains prosciutto, and I got the margarita pizza. For our entrees, I got the pappardelle bolognese, which is a beef ragu. Matthew got the taglatelli pasta with lobster, looks yummy. And he also got a side of sauteed mushrooms. sweet spot at the end, dessert. I got my tiramisu, of course, and Matthew got the cheesecake, which comes with a white peach gelato. Okay. We had a fabulous dinner at Onda. Excellent. It made up for the spirit experience. It was much better. Um, we are off to the production show Kinky Boots tonight. Yes. In now, comfier clothes. Yes. Yes. Now, I will make note of this. This is the very last performance of Kinky Boots on a Norwegian ship. The very, very, very last. So, we're seeing it for the first time <laughs> on the very last show. So, we're kind of excited to see how it is. We heard some of the performers on their Christmas special, mm -hmm. so I'm looking forward to a very good musical performance, and we'll see how it goes. So, we'll show you what we can show you, probably not much, sorry, yeah. in advance. We made it to the theater, waiting on the show to start. Should be good. It's special because um, it was the final night that you will see this cast. Um, it is also the final night that Kinky Boots will be on NCL ships for the foreseeable future. So, uh, I just want to thank you all on behalf of everybody here, uh, up in the booth, backstage, down in the pit. Thank you all. Thank you. Thank you. Comment cards, please. Yes, yes. Share it on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, Snapchat, whatever you have. Hashtag Kiki Boots NCL. Yes, yes. And I just want to say, lastly, thank you, thank you, thank you, each and every one of you. Thank you for being here tonight and supporting us. 
happy holidays, and good night. Well, good evening, or as I should say, good morning, mm -hmm. because it's now past midnight. Mm -hmm. So, that was uh, an incredible last show of Kinky Boots on mm -hmm. the Norwegian Encore. Um, you could tell that they gave it their heart and soul in that oh, yeah. final production. So, yeah. It was incredible. Um, yeah. Excellent, excellent. Um, so, we are going to call it a night because um, we do have St. Thomas in the morning, or later this morning, I should say. Um, we are doing an excursion that leads to 10.30, and Susan <laughs> at breakfast this morning. Uh, we were talking to Jay, the restaurant manager, and... Um, he said, well, I'm going to send coffee and croissants to your room in the morning. Susan goes, oh, six o'clock would be great. I was not thinking he should have picked it. He was more awake than me. <laughs> Our excursion's not till 1030. Should, yeah, I should have said eight. So, so Matthew will be up at six o'clock in the morning to receive the coffee and danishes that are coming. <laughs> so Sleeping Beauty here can sleep in and enjoy her coffee once she does wake up. <laughs> and she got nicknamed that from my mother because she slept really long one of the days when we were there and uh, my mom goes, is Sleeping Beauty going to get up today? And I'm like, I don't know, I'll go wake her up. I like sleep. I so, sleep. we're going to call it a night and uh, we'll Catch you in the morning. Good night. Good night.